U.S. Senator Bob Casey held a press conference at the Allegheny County Courthouse this morning to discuss the proposed health care bill and how it could impact millions of Americans. Look, I'll get right to it. We just got another version of the Republican Senate health care bill. They, it seems like they've been producing a different version every couple of hours. And you know what? It's as bad as the others. Uh, what they've proposed is really not much different than what they've been proposing for weeks and months now. And this is what happens when you have a closed process. John and Beth Gillespie credited the Affordable Care Act for being able to get health care to treat Beth's epilepsy. The Beaver Falls couple had been paying $2,300 a month for health care in 2010 before Obamacare was implemented. So along comes the Affordable Care Act, and what we actually ended up being able to do was drop our insurance premium to $900 a month for the two of us, which was a godsend. And because we got into UPMC, we got her into one of the epilepsy study procedures, and they were able to do a brain surgery where a major surgery where they were able to stop the majority of the seizures that she was taking. We haven't completely gotten out of that. You know, she still has some from time to time, but it's a miracle compared to what we had before and what we had after. If the Affordable Care Act is rolled back, he said they would not be able to afford health care coverage. It's easy to concentrate on what's going on now and kind of forget about the past, but if we end up going back to what we had in the past, then that's when people are really going to find out just how bad things are going to end up being. For Times Online, I'm Kate Malangowski.